Hi DIYers and welcome to my channel. I'm Crafty Lady Etta. Now today we're going to be doing a very special project. So if you like what I do, please comment below. I would love to hear your comments and see your comments. Now tap that notification bell and, notif and YouTube will notify you of any upcoming videos. And like and subscribe. So you will need started. a cutting board. You're going to need some uh, a styrofoam ball paint it black you're going to need a little container that I bought at the Dollar Tree you're going to need some ribbon and red and black felt you'll need some fox fur you'll need some scissors okay let's get started hi dear wires welcome back to my channel I'm crafty lady Etta now today i'm going to show you how to make a cute adorable little puppy puppy using this uh, box fur okay it's going to be cute now what you're going to do is you're going to need a, a bottle i bought this at the dollar tree with a wide opening okay because part of the box fur is going to go inside now what I'm going to do is I'm going to measure the bottom because I'm going to want to uh, cut the bottom. So I'll just measure it. And then I'm going to cut it. Okay, now, what I did was I just cut this and measured it and I hot glued it down to the bottom because I, wanna, I want the bottom to have a... Now, what you're going to do next, you're going to get your fox fur. We're going to measure it. Okay, so you're going to lay it down like this because this is the way the little puppy fur is going to be, okay? This part right here. So... You're going to lay it down. See the edge right here? You're going to lay it down on the edge here and this right here. And you're going to turn it. Keeping the keeping this aligned. Okay. Now you're going to be keeping this. See this? aligned right here on this edge and it has to stay aligned with that edge you're going to keep turning it i had to cut off another piece because apparently this was not enough so we're going to have to cover this piece with this okay so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to measure okay now we're going to measure the top because it's going to have to be one and a half inches from this part. So here's one and a half inches. So right, see this right here? This is exactly one and a half inch right there. You see it? Right here. That's half an inch. So right from here, that's where the one and a half inch should be. So what you're going to do is you're going to mark it here because that's how much you're going to cut it okay okay now okay now you're going to get your exacto knife and you're going to cut along here make sure you're cutting it on top of a matting board and be very careful not to cut yourself
Okay, now we're going to do, um, you're going to tuck this part in. I had to cut about another half inch off this top with scissors. I just went around and cut it. It's a little bit too long because you're going to tuck this in. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to tuck this in a little bit at a time. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to hot glue it. And just tuck it in and hold it. ears now you're going to have the ears hang over like this okay so I would say about let me see well, here's this one. okay I would say maybe about like this long I like that so I would say this is about maybe about three inches. two pieces and you're going to glue them together okay the fur has to be coming down this way Okay, now you're going to take the fur and kind of like flop it over a little bit to cover up the seam, okay? On both of them. Okay, now that we finished the puppy, we fix his hair, his ears. See? Okay. That came out cute. It's okay if you put his hair up a little bit. He's a shaggy dog. <laughs> He's so adorable. Now we're going to make the, the tongue and the ears. Um, for the nose, I, I, I didn't have a cotton ball, so I'm going to have to use this for the nose and this for the tongue. Okay? So let me go ahead and cut that up. Okay, now I glue. Now I glued his tongue to his nose, so now I'm going to put it about right here, okay? I'm gonna have to hold it down. Okay, see that? Now, 
we're gonna do a bow for his hair. I got some pink ribbon to do a bow. Okay, here's a little doggy. I made her a little bow. She's so adorable. You can do these in any color. I'll be doing another one with a different color. Okay, just fix the hair. And it's okay if the hair looks a little messed up. It's a little, it's a cute little puppy. Okay, look at that, adorable. Okay, there she is. I'm all done. Isn't she cute? Look at that, she's adorable. Oh my gosh, so cute. This will make such a nice gift for a little girl or whoever you want, anybody that's a dog lover. I'm gonna be doing some more of these, different colors. Maybe even some that are a little taller. But there you go. So if you like what I do, please uh, consider subscribing. And please, please comment below. I would love to hear your comments. I have a lot of people subscribing, but I have no one commenting. Um, I would love to hear what you think, what your comments are. Uh, but be kind. And if there's anything else you'd like me to do or try, let me know. I'll be more than happy to. Okay? So tap that notification bell and YouTube will notify you of any upcoming videos and like and subscribe. There's more awesome videos coming up. I'm going to be doing a lot more and also Christmas stuff. I'm going to be doing a lot of Christmas DIYs. Some really awesome stuff. Okay, so with all that being said, bye. Keep on crafting.